Hey there, welcome to Unstoppable Journeys. If you're new here, I'm thrilled to have you. Today we're diving into a topic that isn't just relevant, it's crucial preparing for an economic collapse. Whether we like it or not, economic downturns are a part of our world. The goal of this video is to help you stay motivated and ready for any economic challenges that might come your way. Let me share a quick story with you. A few years ago, I faced a sudden job loss. The fear and uncertainty were overwhelming. I remember thinking, what if I can't pay my bills? What if I lose everything? It was a wake-up call that made me realize the importance of preparation. I'm sure many of you have similar fears and uncertainties, especially in today's unpredictable world. But trust me, with the right mindset and preparation, we can turn these challenges into opportunities. In this video, we'll cover several key areas to help you prepare for an economic collapse. We'll start by understanding what an economic collapse is and the signs to look out for. Then, we'll move on to financial preparation, including building an emergency fund, diversifying income, and reducing debt. We'll also discuss physical and mental preparation, such as stockpiling essentials and developing practical skills. Finally, we'll talk about the importance of community and networking during tough times. Each section is packed with valuable insights that will keep you engaged and ready to take action. So, what exactly is an economic collapse? Simply put, it's a severe and prolonged economic downturn where normal economic activities are disrupted. This can include a sharp decline in GDP, massive unemployment, and widespread financial instability. Some common signs that indicate an impending economic downturn include a significant drop in stock markets, rising unemployment rates, increasing debt levels, declining consumer confidence. By recognizing these signs early on, we can better prepare ourselves for what's to come. To give you some perspective, let's look at a few historical examples of economic collapses. One of the most well-known is the Great Depression of the 1930s. It was a time of immense hardship where millions lost their jobs and homes. People had to rely on soup kitchens and barter systems to survive. Another example is the 2008 financial crisis, which led to massive job losses and foreclosures. During these times, those who were prepared with savings and multiple income streams fared much better than those who weren't. Being prepared both mentally and financially has numerous benefits. It can reduce stress by providing a sense of security and control over your situation. Moreover, it increases your resilience, allowing you to bounce back more quickly from setbacks. Preparation isn't just about survival, it's about thriving even in tough times. When you're prepared, you're not just reacting to events, you're proactively shaping your future. One of the most critical aspects of financial preparation is having an emergency fund. This is a stash of money set aside specifically for unexpected expenses or emergencies. So how much should you save? A good rule of thumb is to have three to six months worth of living expenses saved up. This cushion can help you cover essential costs like rent, utilities, and groceries if you suddenly lose your income. Relying on a single source of income can be risky. That's why it's essential to diversify your income streams. You can do this through freelancing, starting a side business, or making smart investments. For instance, consider offering your skills as a freelancer on platforms like Upwork or Fiverr. Or perhaps you have a hobby that can be turned into a small business. The key is to have multiple streams of income so that if one dries up, you have others to fall back on. Debt can be a significant burden during an economic downturn. That's why it's crucial to focus on reducing high interest debt as quickly as possible. Start by creating a debt repayment plan. List all your debts from highest interest rate to lowest and tackle them one by one. This approach not only reduces your financial burden but also frees up more money for savings and investments. When it comes to physical preparation, stockpiling essentials is key. Make sure you have enough non-perishable food items like canned goods, rice, and pasta. Don't forget about water aim for at least one gallon per person per day for three days. Medical supplies are also crucial. Have basic first aid kits, prescription medications, and over-the-counter drugs like pain relievers stocked up. Proper storage is essential keep these items in a cool, dry place away from direct sunlight. Another vital aspect of preparation is developing practical skills. 
Learn how to grow your own food through gardening or how to cook from scratch using basic ingredients. Basic repair skills can also be incredibly useful during tough times. There are plenty of online resources and community classes available that can help you develop these skills without spending much money. Maintaining mental resilience during challenging times is just as important as physical preparation. Practices like meditation and regular exercise can significantly improve your mental health. Staying connected with friends and family is another way to bolster your mental resilience. Social connections provide emotional support and can make tough times more bearable. Having a strong support network can make all the difference during an economic collapse. Surround yourself with like-minded individuals who share your goals and values. You can connect with people through local groups or online forums focused on preparedness and self-sufficiency. These connections can provide valuable advice, resources, and emotional support when you need it most. Sharing resources with trusted friends and family can be incredibly beneficial during tough times. For example, you could barter services perhaps you're great at fixing things while your friend has excellent cooking skills. Pooling supplies is another effective strategy. By sharing what you have with others in your network, everyone benefits without having to bear the full burden alone. Finally, don't underestimate the power of volunteering and giving back to your community. Helping others not only builds stronger community bonds but also provides personal fulfillment. Consider volunteering at local shelters or food banks or offering your skills to those in need within your community. These actions create a ripple effect that strengthens the entire community's resilience during tough times. Let's quickly recap what we've covered today. Understanding what an economic collapse is and recognizing its signs. The importance of financial preparation building an emergency fund, diversifying income streams, and reducing debt. Physical preparation stockpiling essentials and developing practical skills. Mental resilience maintaining mental health through meditation, exercise, and social connections. Building a strong support network within your community by sharing resources and volunteering. Preparation isn't just about surviving, it's about thriving, even when times get tough. If you found this video helpful, please hit the subscribe button for more motivational content from Unstoppable Journeys. Don't forget to like this video if it resonated with you and leave a comment sharing your thoughts or experiences related to economic preparation. Remember resilience isn't just about bouncing back, it's about bouncing forward stronger than ever before. By taking steps now to prepare for any economic downturns, you're not only safeguarding your future but also empowering yourself to face any challenge head-on. Stay unstoppable.